very good morning uh, i am sri krishnan divakaran so i just want to start off by saying like in today's world so uh, what what do we do at kriya we equip students to solve problems like for example if you look at climate change okay so you will see that if you if you want to solve this problem uh, just understanding just how a computer work doesn't help you need to have an understanding of how the eco the ecology works how the people's behavior are, uh, is affected how the government's policies are influenced so in computer science one of the things which we do is we equip students with the ability to solve problems so how do we do that so what we essentially do is first thing is we <coughs> provide them with the basic skills uh, computational skills basic mathematical and analytical skills okay and now these skills without knowledge without applying these skills it would not be of much use so what we do is we provide opportunities where students can explore during the first year through the foundation program they can explore other areas like say they can understand a little bit of economics they can understand a little bit of environmental sciences psychology so essentially what happens is during that exploration they not only they go beyond awareness they understand what are the various challenges what are the different perspectives and then what happens is we help them to develop Uh, conceptual skills mathematical skills help them to build models and we also provide an environment wherein the students are able to work with people from different backgrounds go on field trips okay and use different tools where like say for example if i am looking at the economics of climate change then i need to understand what are the various costing models i need to be introduced to various aspects of economics so an economist is going to look at a different perspective a computer scientist is going to look at a different perspective a mathematician is going to look at a different perspective one what we want our students to do is to be able to solve problems and also have the ability to be able to be learn on their own so what we provide here is an environment where they are very they are able to think critically they are independent thinkers okay and they are able to uh, ask questions their curiosity is maintained and in some cases we challenge them so that uh, that challenge brings the best out of them so that is uh, that is that i would say is the strength and here also you will see there are speakers from all over the world from various disciplines who come in and provide different perspectives and it provides a culture where people don't feel f- free to explore they don't feel free they don't uh, feel inhibited to ask questions they are very curious the curiosity is spurred at the same time we challenge them because we give them uh, uh, problems or context where they go beyond their comfort zone so that i would say would be the strength and in today's world uh, uh, most of the problems are multidisciplinary so if i am only restricting myself to a single discipline then it becomes very difficult to uh, become useful in the real world okay so that is the strength of kriya so i hope uh, you get, uh, the, the students who are looking at it look at kriya because we are looking for the future we are looking at equipping students so that they not only are good in the next 5 years but they are able to be productive through the rest of their life